welcome back to the channel i'm alan and today we're going to talk about caravan cleaning now i know before um, i start that there's been loads of videos about cleaning caravans so a little bit of a backstory here we've just been away to scotland and we've stayed on a site where we're parked for a week under trees and by the time we're ready to come away the top, the sides, basically any surface of the caravan was covered in these little micro spots of tree sap and to touch they were sticky and the whole side of the caravan, top of the caravan, the glass everywhere is covered in little sticky dots of tree sap. Now I want to, I'm only, we're only back a week so what I wanted to do was to try and get the caravan cleaned and get all this sap off the caravan before it starts to maybe stain or, or look pretty pretty ugly right so what i'm going to use is pro shot 40 shot multi-surface cleaner now the reason for this is i saw a video from phil at lost weekends caravans i'll stick a link to his channel below so you can take a look uh, and he did a very green caravan with the stuff now i'm not into anything that's abrasive so i don't use a brush what i have is a communal gardener garden straight out of wilkinson's microfiber floor uh cleaner so basically just that i want that to be able to lift anything that's on the surface especially of the roof um the sponges i use again microfiber they do have a bit of a webbing on the back in case there is something a little bit more stubborn uh, a standard wash mitt which is pretty much the same and of course microfiber towels now like i said i don't like anything that's that's likely to cause any scratches or any marks or whether there's, there's a likelihood that i may damage the caravan so i won't be using anything with a hard surface that could cause a mark now what what attracted me with the with the pro shop was first of all we we use the pro shop toilet chemical and we find it absolutely fantastic so in using this what we're hoping is we still maintain that biodegradable um, content uh, it is really concentrated so you're not using a vast amount of it although what i have done is this recommends 25 milliliters per 10 liters of water but for anything that's really stubborn i've just made up a little bottle uh, which is 10 times the strength so so i've got that where i can put on just let it soak and get in now it does say on here that you can use this neat if you need to so I, you know, i'm fairly sure i'll be okay with the with just using something a little bit more concentrated now as well as this it has the waxes in as well as the cleaner so i'm hoping that will maintain a little bit of the shine i may have to still polish the caravan afterwards we'll we'll wait and see how it goes I'm hoping as well that this will also do uh, a pretty good job on the rear end and side of the caravans you know where you're getting little tar spots my normal go-to is silky but that means i'm going to spend a whole day literally just cleaning the sides and the bottom rails of the caravans with with silky because it really is a manual intensive job i'm hoping the chemicals in this will actually uh, do a do a lot more work uh, and and get this nice and clean and shiny so we will see i'll take you up top it's pretty hard to see because like i said they're like micro spots of sap and and the clear so it, the caravan's not immensely dirty it's just when you run i don't know if you've ever had it on your car where you run your hand over the top and it feels like a very light grade sandpaper where you've got the sap on the car and you can't actually see it but you can feel that it's there you know the sort of, and it's the sort of thing where you would maybe start thinking about if you're detailing a car looking at a clay bar to actually get that grit and muck off your car well that's the sort of thing we've got on the top of the caravan uh, so i'm hoping this will do the job so we'll make a start i'll take you up top at the back we'll have a look at the top of the caravan like i said it's not immensely dirty uh, and we'll we'll see how good a job i actually think this does so uh, come back to us in a bit okay so we're now outside and i'm just going to show you the back of the caravan like i said it's not horrendously dirty uh, but it does have 
some marks on you can see probably at the end there where the, the sap is a little bit darker in color a couple of marks at the bottom but we'll have a quick look up top as well then you can then you can see so like I said this is the top of the caravan and we can see maybe you can see the sap you can certainly feel it uh, but you can also see around the the roof lights there this has been fairly well cleaned as well uh, but I never lift the skylights when I wash the caravan so this is the first time it's going to get a real proper clean and what my intention is I'm first going to just spray it down get the whole thing wet and from there what we'll do is we'll just put a little bit of concentrate around the uh, the roof light just to give it a bit more of a fighting chance and then we'll see how we get on with the rest so like I said at the outset it didn't look horrendously dirty but you can see literally just with a quick spray and a wipe with a microfiber that that in itself is a massive difference and you can see some of the crud that's, that's now on the edge of the caravan so what I'm going to do is I'm going to crack on with the rest and come back to you once we've got the roof finished see you in a bit I just thought I'd bring you back up top for a quick one because uh, I wash the roof every time I wash the caravan um, but I don't always open the skylight and this is after 18 months it's uh, not looking too brilliant but we'll give it a quick squirt with Pro Shot and we'll see how it looks once we'll give it a few minutes just to sink in right we've got the, the caravan roof finished and I said before I was going to use sort of a floor uh, wash type microfiber mitt. I haven't actually used that. All I've used is the Pro Shot Cleaner in its 25ml to 10 litre concentrate. Admittedly, I've got, I've got, I have used the concentrate bottle around the window seals because uh, they certainly did get quite green. Uh, but what I'm going to do is now take you up on top and show you what it looks like. So this is the this is the roof. Now it's cleaned. I'm absolutely astonished because it was it's still wet. Even in the, the few areas that are dry, it does have a fantastic shine. to get a coat of something like Bobby Dazzler or whether I will polish it but that is looking absolutely stunning and I think even down to the, uh, the top of the lights the star gazer light there you can see the shine on the top absolutely fantastic right on with the rest of the caravan right so the caravan's actually clean uh, what we'll do is we'll have a quick look round um, and just have a look at it because there's a few spots on our caravan maybe you get the same on yours where the muck does tend to really get a hold and it always seems to look unsightly when you get back from a trip so we'll just have a quick walk around the caravan all right we'll start with the back panel uh, of course that always picks up road grime doesn't it and it's the one that always seems to look the dullest uh, but the pro shot's done a decent job nice shine on there i'm really impressed with how, how it's come up with the windows uh, they seem to have uh, sheeted off and dried really quickly without any problem at all uh, again you know down at the bottom where we have the rail our biggest problem with that is not so much um, the grime that gets on it because that's quite easy to get off it's them tar spots that you get and the pro shot's done a decent job um, in fact what I've done is just gone round the edges with a concentrate and then left it for a couple of minutes sprayed it sprayed it up with water and then just gone off over it with a microfiber and as you can see it's it's come up really nice it's 
So yeah, we changed to Pro Shot for the toilet just over a year ago and we've now purchased the, the Pro Shot Multi Surface because it, it was a recommendation and I have to say I'm quite impressed. Um, it's not been a difficult job. I'm one of these people that does like to um, basically take me time and, and faff on a bit if you like but yeah it, it's come up nice I'm really impressed right time to uh, put some stuff away and I'll catch up with you inside the caravan so what's the verdict pro shot exterior multi clean eco friendly biodegradable cleans polishes and is anti static uh, for me it's done a really good job now I'm not in a position where lots are where you know you can try all sorts of different products uh, I've got the caravan on the drive at home I can pop out I can potter about a bit I can take me time and I can spend probably more time than the most especially people who have the caravans in storage uh, because I'm going to the house and have my tea and then come back out again and and do whatever um, right but pro shot or 40 shot should I say from from pro shop um, it's nice and easy obviously we're having the concentrate so you've got the fill bottle you're putting your 25 millilitres to 10 litres of water uh, I've used two buckets full on my caravan yes that I know I wanted to get all the sap off and get the roof looking looking nice and to be honest the roof is gleaming it's probably the best it's ever looked uh, and that's without me giving it another coat of polish that's just just using this product um, and it's it's actually brought the tar spots off pretty well normally I'd I'd uh, I'd be out with the silky and a paintbrush and just you know gently uh, rubbing away till they till they come off but I'd, I made up a concentrate uh, of which I used uh, 10 mil in a one litre bottle and just sprayed that on and let that soak in and I went around the rails the wheel arches um, up the awning rail you know the general places where you really do get a lot of dirt and grime and also around the the skylights where you get where you tend to get that green and a normal wash you don't lift the skylights so you still you get the green build up underneath so i'd give everywhere a good squirt uh left it to soak in and then wet the caravan and give it give it a wash as normal and it, it's done a really good job i'm really i'm really impressed and now phil's recommended this for us absolutely spot on and uh, we're certainly going to be sticking so that's our new caravan cleaner uh, 40 shot exterior multi clean brilliant bit of kit hope you enjoyed the video if you did please like subscribe leave us a comment let us know what you use to clean your caravan uh, and i'm sure you don't take four or five hours like i take with with mine uh, but saying that i'll probably drink about five or six cup of coffee in the process as well so anyway you take care you stay safe until the next one see you later